All right, everybody. I don't think this thing started recording earlier. I got a piece of pig nut hickory on here from out in the yard that a tree bro tree went down, or a huge half of it did. So we're just going to go ahead and round this off and see what we can make out of it. I apologize for anything that we've missed with the video. So let's see if this works. All right. I really don't want to take too much more off, but I got to get those cracks out. I want to try to keep some of this. This is going to be nice. All right, yeah, we're just going to go ahead and stick with this. I'm going to clean up these cracks and fill them. A couple grounds. Since we're going to be using some CA glue, let's make sure the wood ain't going to get messed up. <clears throat> Bring you back. Okay, we're back. We're going to go ahead and throw some coffee grounds down up in hell. And these smaller ones we don't need to, we just need to drop the glue in. We don't really need to uh, do any coffee grounds. <clears throat> All right, try to get this stuff to seal up, harden. And then we'll get back to it again. Make sure we get all these smaller ones here. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and do a, another pass on this, and then I'm gonna have to shut it down for a bit. I've gotta go run and grab some din din. But let's get a pass going real fast. It's not looking bad. I'm probably going to do, probably going to need to put a little bit more in there. But those smaller cracks definitely look like it's uh, done well. Okay, 
Yeah, but you only got a couple small things to fill. All right. Let that dry. Go out and grab the stuff I need to grab and come back and we'll do some more later. All right, y'all. I'll be back. All right, we are back again. Got the cracks filled. Everything should be just about dried. I'm going to work on the outside and hopefully I can get it flipped over and the inside done before I have to pop off for the day. So I'm going to get the scraper out now. I think we can work with that. All right, looks like it did pretty well. I don't like that discoloration. Let's see if I can get that out. This whiteness is actually in the wood because it's not coming out. All right, we'll get some sanding going. Okay, we're up to 400. I'm gonna hit it with some denatured alcohol and then hit it with another 400 again just to clean her up.
Okay, we got our pig nut hickory here. Um, sanded. 400 on the outside, 240 on the inside. Uh, we've got a sealer, a Minwax uh, sanding sealer on it. Hit it with 600 grit. Uh, I've already done a light one. I'm not sure if the video picked it up, so we're just going to do it again. And then we will put the denatured alcohol and a finish. Nice and light. alcohol out, get the flat tip. So I've got a new camera set up to where I've got a screen with the mini HDMI cable hooked up to the camera to where I can actually see what the camera is seen. So now I'll know if I'm in frame, if I'm recording or not recording, I'll at least be able to see that now. Before, I had to keep checking the camera. Had to keep checking the camera. Alright, let's spin this up. Help drying it real quick. Got our wipe on poly ready. first coat. Can't wait till I pick up my lights. I'll be able to see on the inside better. Grab a chip brush so I can get the box. down in every creek and crevice. Should be about time for these bristles to start popping off. side it's already starting to soak in
put it on a slow spin and then I bring you back when I'm taking the tenon off okay everybody we're back we've got it uh, one coat of polyurethane finish on it it's going to definitely need another coat or two uh, to get it to where I want it to be at um, we're ready to take the tenon off and it looks like you should be able to see my removal yep so let's go ahead and get her done give it a little bit of a design if I can get in here Touch up with the smaller spindle. All right. It looks like it's a slight concave, so we're happy. Lower down. We're at 480. Wiggle, wiggle, slow it down some more. 300, and we're off. So that's what we ended up with on the bottom. All I gotta do now is take the sander to it, touch it up, sign it, get it finished, and then we'll come back for picks.